Hi, my name is Lynette Chia. I'm a faculty member in engineering systems. I'm representing Singapore for the ASEAN US Science Prize for Women in 2017. The theme of this year's prize is on urbanization or the growth in the urban population. Uh, within Southeast Asia alone, more than 90 million people are expected to move into cities by year 2030. Um, rapid and unplanned urban growth actually is a threat to sustainable development. How do we address urban sprawl? How do we reduce the polluting effects? And how do we design transportation systems in cities to be less congested and less polluting? So my research goal is to look at sustainable urban mobility. I develop models and tools to reduce the environmental impact of road transport. So I collect real-world data and try to optimize uh, the way goods and people are moved around the city. Uh, some of the projects I worked on include one that evaluated cleaner technologies to diesel vehicles, which are known to emit more air emissions. I've also looked at the topic of freight transportation. So this is about the movement of goods in cities with growing population and increasing demand for goods. How do we plan and make this system more efficient? So I collect data on commodity flows, I develop freight demand models, and I also assess freight-friendly policies. So this is work that I do in partnership with my research team of uh, the young researchers and students. Uh, I feel very privileged to work with them and I'm very happy for them when they do well. So one of my students really actually won a Best Student Prize in a conference and she's now pursuing her graduate studies at MIT. I've been with SUTD or the Singapore University of Technology and Design for the past few years. SUTD was set up in collaboration with MIT. Our mission is to nurture technically grounded innovators and leaders. I work within the engineering systems and design pillar. So our students here learn to analyze and model large-scale complex systems and they apply design towards solving real-world challenges, multidisciplinary challenges. I'm a strong supporter of uh, promoting STEM or science, technology, engineering and math to the young, especially among women. So at SUTD, more than 40% of our students are women, which is higher than average. We actively recruit women and offer scholarships to women. I think that the ASEAN US Science Prize for Women is a great platform to promote the work and highlight the careers of female scientists in the region. Uh, I hope we can continue to encourage young students and scientists to continue what they do, that is to find a passion, be it climate change, better healthcare, or better transportation in cities and to pursue it actively.